Hello there ladies and gentlemen. This is a continuation to the first video where I talked about how to compose a formal email. Okay, You all know by now the four rules of a formal or business email. It must have a subject. The subject is a summary of what you want to say. It must have a formal greeting. It must have a body and it must have a conclusion. In this email, I'm going to compose a formal email and I'm going to show you how it should look like and how I will mark your work when you guys do it. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to click on the new mail sign right here on this email. As you can see, this email client is how the school email looks like. This is how your email will look like when you log in. So I clicked on new email here. Now I'm going to click on the two box and I'm going to pretend Miss Long, I'm Miss Long and I'm sending an email to Mr. Ball. Okay, so I'll put in Mr. Ball's email first. So in the to section, I'll put S Ball at, um, let's make it up, excite.com. Okay, let's pretend that's Mr. Ball's email. And then for the subject, I'm going to write something about a meeting. So let's say ICT meeting. So the email is going to be on about an imaginary ICT meeting that's supposed to be happening. So I'll put in the ICT meeting and then I will start. First rule of a formal email was a subject. I've got my subject right there. Second rule of a formal email was that it must have a salutation or a greeting. So, dear Mr. Paul, that's my salutation, okay? Third rule of a formal email is that it must have a body. So, I'll type in what I need to type. This email is to inform you about the ICT meeting. Please, let me, please make sure that you attend. Full stop. So I've got my subject, I've got my greeting, I've now got <clears throat> the body the final thing is the end which is the conclusion and I'll put in kind regards give me one second this needs to be small r kind regards mr oh sorry miss k long done and what I've done there is I've composed the formal email okay I've got the subject here I've got the salutation or the greeting I've got the main body and I've got my conclusion. Now that is how you compose and send a formal email. When I'm done, I'll simply go and click on send and my email will be sent. Okay. Now you need to go and answer the questions on how to send a formal email. Okay. Thank you.